Bile acid male absorption, known also as bile acid diarrhea, is a cause of chronic diarrhea. It has also been called bile acid induced diarrhea, cholahic or choleretic enteropathy, and bile salt male absorption. It can result from male absorption secondary to gastrointestinal disease, or be a primary disorder, associated with excessive bile acid production. Treatment with bile acid sequestrants is often effective. Classification Bile acid male absorption was first recognized in patients with allele disease. When other causes were recognized, and an idiopathic, primary form described, a classification into three types was proposed, type 1, bile acid male absorption, secondary to allele resection, or allele inflammation, type 2, idiopathic bile acid male absorption, primary bile acid diarrhea, type 3, secondary to various gastrointestinal diseases including cholecystectomy, vagotomy, small intestinal bacterial overgrowth, radiation enteropathy, celiac disease, chronic pancreatitis, etc. Mechanisms of disease, enterohepatic circulation of bile salts, bile acids are produced in the liver, secreted into the biliary system, stored in the gallbladder and are released after meals stimulated by cholecystokinin. They are important for the digestion and absorption of fats in the small intestine. Usually over 95% of the bile acids are absorbed in the terminal ileum and are taken up by the liver and resecreted. This enterohepatic circulation of bile acids takes place 4 to 6 times in 24 hours and usually less than 0.5 g 24 hours of bile acids enter the large intestine. When larger amounts of bile acids enter the large intestine, they stimulate water secretion and intestinal motility in the colon, which causes symptoms of chronic diarrhea. Intestinal absorption of bile acids The ileum is very efficient at absorbing the glyco and taurin conjugated forms of the bile salts. The apical sodium dependent bile salt transporter is the first step in absorption at the brush border membrane. The cytoplasmic allele bile acid binding protein and the basolateral heterodimer of OSTE plus or minus and OSTE squared transfer bile acids through and out of the cell where they eventually enter the portal vein. These bile acid transporters are all highly expressed in the ileum but not in the liver, jejunum or colon. When expression of these specialized transporters is reduced, the intestine is less efficient at bile acid reabsorption. If intestinal motility is affected by gastrointestinal surgery, or bile acids are deconjugated by small intestinal bacterial overgrowth, absorption is less efficient. A very small proportion of the patients with no obvious disease may have mutations in ASBT, but this mutation is not more common in most patients and does not affect function. Overproduction of bile acids, primary bile acid diarrhea may be caused by an overproduction of bile acids. Several groups of workers have failed to show any defect in allele bile acid absorption in these patients, and they have an enlarged bile acid pool, rather than the reduced pool expected with male absorption. The synthesis of bile acids in the liver is negatively regulated by the allele hormone fibroblast growth factor 19, and lower levels of this hormone result in overproduction of bile acids, which are more than the ileum can absorb. Diagnosis Several methods have been developed to identify the disorder but there are difficulties with all of them. Fecal bile acid quantification is unpleasant for both the patient and laboratory. Diagnosis of bile acid male absorption is easily and reliably made by the SAHCAT test. This nuclear medicine test involves two scans a week apart and so measures multiple cycles of bile acid excretion and reabsorption. There is limited radiation exposure. Retention of say HCAT at 7 days is normally above 15%. Values less than 15%, 10% and 5% predict respectively mild, moderate and severe abnormal retention and an increasing likelihood of response to bile acid sequestrants. This test is not licensed in the USA, and is underutilized even where it is available. Older methods such as the 14C glycocolic breath test are no longer in routine clinical use. Measurement of 7 alpha hydroxy 4 coalescin 3 1, a bile acid precursor, in serum, showed the increased bile acid synthesis found in bile acid male absorption. This test is an alternative diagnostic means when available. 
fasting blood FGF19 values may have value in the recognition of the disease and prediction of response. Prevalence, bile acid male absorption is common in Crohn's disease but not always recognized. Most patients with previous allele resection and chronic diarrhea will have abnormal say HCAT tests and can benefit from bile acid sequestrants. Patients with primary bile acid diarrhea are frequently misdiagnosed as having the irritable bowel syndrome as clinicians fail to recognize the condition. When say HCAT testing is performed, the diagnosis of primary bile acid diarrhea is commonly made. In a review of 18 studies of the use of say HCAT testing in diarrhea predominant irritable bowel syndrome patients, 32% of 1223 patients had a say HCAT 7 day retention of less than 10%, and 80% of these reported a response to cholesterol, a bile acid sequestrant. Estimates of the population prevalence taken from this review suggest that 1% of the adult population could have primary bile acid diarrhea. Treatment Bile acid sequestrants are the main agents used to treat bile acid male absorption. Cholesterol and cholestipol both in powder form, have been used for many years. Unfortunately many patients find them difficult to tolerate. Although the diarrhea may improve, other symptoms such as pain and bloating may worsen. Cholesterol is a tablet and some patients tolerate this more easily. References